Hey, welcome back to Power Range. I'm Dusty. I'm TK. Thanks. Couldn't see nothing behind you. On today's episode, we're just gonna shoot some random things, have a good time. That's what we do it all the time, shoot stuff. Yeah. yeah. Well, he brought some stuff from his house. I was like, all right, let's make a video with that then. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. Stick around to the end, see who gets hit in the face with a pie. We're gonna pop that frying pan and a TV first with a Heritage 22, nothing fancy. It's 22 lead, long rifle. We got a jug behind it, which I'm not sure. I brought two rounds out here at 22, if it's even gonna go through all that. I kind of have my doubts. What do you think, Biggin? Huh? The people know my answer. All right, the people. You good? Mm-hmm. I don't think I went through. No, you hit it on the curve, it just ricocheted off. You good? Yep. Clear. Well, prime pan up 22 long rifle. Mm-hmm. All right, Dusty here, got the Glock 28, chambered in 380 auto, nothing fancy. What do you think, Biggin? I just hope to hit the darn frying pan. You ready? Yep. Well, oh, I went through the firing pan. It smacked the TV. Did it go all the way through? It's in the TV. It didn't go through the TV. Hey, it's DC taking the bread at 92. We're going to be using 9 millimeter full metal jacket. What do you think's gonna happen, little buddy? I know it'll go through the frying pan. I don't know if it'll go all the way through the TV and the frying pan. All right, well you smacked the top of it. It went through the frying pan. Yeah, I think it went through. Hell yeah, got a little bit of leakage back here. A little bit. You nicked it. Right there. Oh yeah, right there. Yep. All right. All right next, the, I didn't have that on. Okay. Next, we're using the FNS 40 by FN. Nothing fancy. Full metal jacket. And we're gonna see if we can pop that jug behind that TV. Oh, hang on, man. It's on photo. Shut up. Okay. You good? Yep. Clear. He can't aim. He can't hit a 10-inch frying pan. Folks, he hit the frying pan and it ricocheted out through the TV. Yeah. <laughs> All right, instead of just throwing the lead at it, we're going to shoot it with a Glock 20 Gen 4, chambered in 10 millimeter. What, what do you think? think? I think you aim right, you're going to pop that jug. You good? Yep. He popped the jug. Right there. And you smack the jug. All right, DC. We'll be using Spear Gold Dot 45 ACP Hollow Point in the Glock 21 Gen 3. All right. See the ain't dead center. There you go. Yep, so I know she went through. Oh yeah, you caught that jug pretty good. Oh. All right, y'all, next we're using the 45 long and this Colt Walker type pistol here. Nothing fancy, just the that's 45 more, lead. more like a um, John Wick pistol. Yeah, like the one he put together real quick. I got two rounds in case I miss. Yeah, we all, we all know that. Our listeners know that too. All right, Biggin, you ready? Listeners, our watchers, you viewers. Ready? Yeah, I get it right. Hey, where are you gonna aim at? Dead center. Uh, okay. 
do one more. You good? Yeah. Oh, you hit just missed completely. Yeah, I did. It ain't way high. Yep. Went through the laptop. And it's in the laptop. Is it in the laptop? Or is it in the TV? That's a big hole right there. Folks, it's kind of hard to do this with one hand. I think it's in the TV. I don't think it came out. Hey y'all, welcome back. <laughs> Got the Rhino 50DS, chambered in 357 Magnum. Yeah. What kind of rounds you got? 357 Magnum. And I got two, cause the barrel is down here and not up here like usual. It's a little awkward to shoot. I think it hit dead center, didn't I? All righty. So went through there. We saw some leakage. Yeah, he popped the water. I'll be using the uh, Rossi in 44 Magnum. Hollow point. That one went through the frying pan. I think that top hole right there is yours. This one right here? I think so. And it just hit the top of the jug. All right, y'all. Next we're using the seven member Mauser. Kind of like a lead soft tip hunting round or something. And we're gonna see if we can pop that jug. You ready? Yeah. Um, where'd you hit at? I don't know, but I didn't see a water pop, so we're gonna try one more again. Oh! There's him right there. Yep. Got it. Didn't quite do the bust but. Ladies and gentlemen, he skid the side of the jug. That's for dang sure. All right, I got the T Rex Slayer, the <laughs> Marlin 1895 guy gun, chambered in 4570. All of it, all I got in there is the red tip. I got a, uh, I'll save that for last. Alright, Biggin. Ready? Yep. Oh, that jug didn't. Hang Smack on. it forward. There you go. This is just the jug. Yeah. You lead round? Yeah. I mentioned my shoulder hurts a little bit. <laughs>
Well, Dusty, I think you, uh, I think you took it out, man. You busted it up pretty good, but I'm proud of you. Good job. I don't get the power for that reason, huh? Well, we, we'll see. We'll see. Dang. Guys, you want to buy a laptop? We'll sell them to you half off. I got the hard drive. <laughs> all right, y'all. Hope y'all enjoyed that episode. How do you get stuff all over your little hat, buddy? Get out of here. Please remember. Oh, hey. Please remember sorry. like. Thank you for watching today's episode. Please remember. Please like. remember to like, comment, subscribe. It means the world to us. It does. Uh, what else? That's. Uh, we well, had a good, pretty good time, pretty man. Pretty good time. Pretty good time out here. The only thing that didn't make it through was the 22, but everything else kind of went through the frying pan and stuff. Yeah, if you can hit your target, uh, it works good. <laughs> yeah, I did hit the top of that daggum thing. But it, it was cool, though. Did you have yeah. a good time? Yeah. Oh, I'll always have a blast. All right. Well, what we're going to do, what we're, we're going to leave it up to we're the... Leave it up to the certain individual, yes. Lady behind us to holler out a name on the count of three. One, One two, two, three. One, two, three, four, five. Dusty. I that, figure I should, she likes all of my name. <laughs> so we're going to get the pie ready. Be right back for some pedidness. Pie business. See, Ray, look at you, don't you? I'm doing it. You don't get to do it. I'm doing it. <laughs> you know what I was going to do. All right. So it's not too bad today. It looks cold. Well, it probably is cold. Holy. Hang on a minute. Let me get you. There we go. It's still a lot in the plate. <laughs> it didn't stick too good to you today. That stuff's still, still way too cold. But it done pretty good. That's cool. Little tastes like dusty too. Yeah. All right. Dusty out. TK gone.